T minus one minute. Let's go. The key to getting the lip shape is to draw a line extending up from where your bottom lip ends, very much like how you draw your eyeliner extending from your bottom lash line. So the main place this look is overdrawn is right here in the corners above the upper lip. From there, the rest is pretty simple. With a curved line, connect that over to your top lip and line the rest normally or overdrawn in the cupid's bow if you'd like. Line the bottom lip normally, which should easily connect to the first lines that you made. I find this look works best with dark colors and liquid matte lipsticks using a small angled brush. Once you get the shape down, you can fill in the rest of the lip with a solid color or do an ombre lip like I did here. If you want to sharpen the line or adjust the shape, you can use concealer on an angled brush to clean it up. Every time I post a picture using this lip shape on Instagram, I get a ton of requests for a tutorial. This lip shape photographs great, but as you can see, it's very dramatic and obvious. If you're not someone who likes the overdrawn look, this clearly isn't the look for you, but remember you can always tone down this look by making your initial lines shorter or making the corners less pointed. <sighs> okay, love you, bye!